In this video, we're going to talk about image capturing that is part of my Design Snap app. So imagine being out somewhere away from your house, away from your machine, and you are somewhere and a relative has a drawing that is special to you. You have a device. It would have your My Design Snap app, but on your device, you probably have a camera app. You simply take your camera app and you will take a picture of the drawing that is special to you. So it's exactly what I'm doing here. I'm just going to take a picture of this drawing. And we have a picture to show you. I'm going to go right here and show you what picture we took. If you're not happy with it, you know how you can retake your picture. In the same vein, say you found a piece of fabric in the store or at someone's house or you have drapes made of this and you want to capture just this portion for adding to placemats or just this portion to add to I don't know, maybe the tablecloth or table runner. You simply just take a regular picture. I'm opening the camera and I'm going to take a picture of this fabric. And there we have a picture of the fabric in the phone. It's just that easy. We haven't used any hoops. We haven't done anything special. We just took pictures with a regular camera in the device. All right. Now, from here, I'm going to swipe over and go to My Design Snap. When you go to My Design Snap, the bottom icon says select the image for pattern editing. Okay, touch that icon and there are those two pictures that we just took. So if you want to stitch out the child's drawing, you select the drawing. It says send to the machine. You touch send to the machine. It sends the drawing to the machine. It tells you it sent it. You touch OK. And the Snap app goes right back to the opening screen going to the machine. I'm going to touch the screen to wake it up from the screensaver. From here I'm going to go to my design center. We're going to load the image. So you touch the load. We are connected with the WLAN. We're going to touch here. Now the, any image you send last is always the top line. So I'll select the top line and it will display over here on the left. There you go. You can see our drawing there. You touch set. It comes up in your edit screen. And if it's faint, you have icons down here that you can bring it in higher. And then you want to see it and you can back down so that you can add your tools here and add whatever you want to it if you need to. And if not, you can just select image and the machine will generate the stitches for you and you can stitch it out. Okay, we're going back to the device because we have that piece of fabric. So if you want to work with that one, going back to image, select our piece of fabric that we took a picture of, send to the machine. The image has been sent. You touch OK. Come back here. Go to your connection icon. A new line item is at the top. Select the top one because that's the last image that was sent to the machine. It will generate and display on the left. There it is. You touch set. There's your display. From this one you can go image because that's the whole thing that's there. And now you can crop and get the piece that you want. Maybe you want the blue one. Maybe you want this yellow one down here in the bottom. Whichever one you want. You're going to crop down to the piece that you want to actually generate. Then you would say OK, and the machine will generate those stitches, and you can stitch it out on whatever project you like. It's just that easy.